Good morning and good evening, participants from East Asia and Latin America. Welcome to the 10th FAILAC Cyber Secretariat Workshop, held virtually for the first time in FAILAC's history. We will now commence the 10th FAILAC Cyber Secretariat Workshop under the theme Global Socioeconomic Prospects and Measures to Strengthen FAILAC Cooperation Under COVID-19. We hope that this workshop may enlighten ways to strengthen and invigorate interregional cooperation among FAILAC member states as we virtually gather in this timely occasion. Throughout the session, participants may ask questions related to the presentation materials through the Q&A tab on the Zoom screen. Please make sure to specify the presenter you are addressing the question to when submitting your question. With this in mind, now ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Kyung Tae Hwang, Director General of the Latin American and Caribbean Affairs Bureau, Ministry of Foreign Affairs of Korea, will deliver his welcoming remarks. Dear, dear representative of Falang member states, experts from both region, ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to extend a warm welcome to everyone attending the 10th Falang Cyber Security Workshop today. We are now going through a difficult time with COVID-19, and the Latin American region has been hardly hit by the rapid spread of the virus in recent times. At this juncture, for the first time in the history of the FAILAC, FAILAC is holding a virtual workshop as part of the cyber security approach to continue communication and the interaction among FAILAC member states. Ever since the establishment of the FAILAC Cyber Secretariat in 2011, the Cyber Secretariat has been playing a significant role in supporting cooperation between East Asia and Latin America. In this regard, I would like to take this opportunity to thank the Cyber Secretariat for all its hard work in facilitating the workings of FAILAC. Representative of FAILAC member states, ladies and gentlemen, taking this opportunity, I would like to take note of some of the challenges that FAILAC faces these days. First of all, FAILAC has not been able to hold official meetings this year due to the global outbreak of COVID-19. I hope this workshop can become a catalyst to reactivate discussions among FAILAC member countries, stimulating great momentum for future FAILAC meetings. The second challenge is to strengthen the institu institutional framework of FAILAC. Recalling the ninth foreign minister's meeting last year, we discussed to strengthen the institutionalization of FAILAC by introducing the rotation system for regional coordinators and revitalizing working groups. Now we need to translate our words into concrete actions to achieve the, achieve the goals of FELA. Another challenge is to enhance regional connectivity through FELA. Accordingly, it is timely to invigorate FELA regional project based on common interests that FELA has shared such as trade, environment, innovation, and sustainable development. In particular, in the face of the COVID-19 pandemic, we are realizing the great importance of international cooperation, especially in health and medical services area. Ladies and gentlemen, the pandemic has changed our daily lives, and it is likely to change many other aspects in the coming days. FAILAC needs to, needs to adapt to the new normal and prepare for the post-COVID-19 world. Today, the Cyber Security Workshops invited experts from the two regions to listen to their insights on global social economic prospects and measures to strengthen FAILAC cooperation on the COVID-19. I hope today's uh, workshop may enlighten us with views and the and ideas on how to take FAILAC a step further in the global as agenda. Once again, I'd like to thank the Cyber Secretary for organizing each workshop and wish all members health and safety. Thanks. <laughs> 